It's been a great year for women's sport. The England cricket team winning the 2020 Cup, Jennifer Ennis grabbing her gold, and the Arsenal ladies gunning their way through the league. But what has happened to you boys? I'm here having a picnic with Linford Christie to see what he has to say on the situation and to see if he's packed his lunchbox. Let's face it, we all hate something about ourselves, some part of our bodies, but if you had a magic wand, what would you change? So if you could change anything about yourself, what would you change? Well, that's a very difficult question, but the main thing I'd probably change would be the uh, company that I keep. You Here's my one. hair. Your hair. <laughs> oh, what's wrong with your hair? I haven't got any. <laughs> oh, so you'd take some of his? Yeah. Probably. Yeah? Yeah, I need a haircut. Oh. Uh, probably my accent, to be honest. Um, oh, I like it. It's, it's nice. It's very regional, but living in London, it's um, it sticks out quite a bit. It seems so, like yeah. nobody's 100% happy with their bodies. But let's face it, who's perfect? I'm off to Harley Street to get some Botox. So, if staying in is the new going out, how come Saturday night television is so diabolical? We're here today to answer the question, is Saturday night television dead? And who better to answer that question is The Sun's own TV critic, Ali Ross. Ali, welcome. Thank you for coming in. Now tell us, just how bad has it got? Welcome back to F1 News. It seems like Team Ferrari are having a few problems with Massa's replacement. With Schumacher now ruled out with a neck injury, will they attempt to steal Alonso from Renault? Or will new rules ensure a Ferrari test driver is put into the hot seat? Who knows, maybe we'll see Rossi treading two wheels in for four. We're trackside today to find out. Women are complex and mysterious creatures who long for love. Is it a single woman's worst nightmare to end up old and alone? There must be a reason why there's six million single women in the UK. <laughs> Any reason why you think there's so many single ladies in the UK? To be honest, um, a lot of girls feel like it seems like they want to get married after one date. Okay, so you've met a few psychos then? Yeah, but I think a lot of girls are like that. Well, will us ladies ever find our dream partners? I don't know about you, but I'm going to keep looking until I say I do.